Hey guys, John here. Uh, I had a couple requests to unbox my uh, new external hard drive, the MyBook, uh, especially user MooseHair999, a uh, subscriber of mine, really wants to see it. So I'm going to do it, but bear with me, I didn't want to set up my camera and stuff, so I'm just going to try it with the eyesight. See how it works. Might not be the best, but we'll give it a whirl. Anyway, like I showed you earlier, this is the MyBook. Um, I bought it from Costco. Which, for those of you that don't know, it's a uh, warehouse um, store. They sell things in, in bulk or large purchases. And uh, they happen to have this MyBook drive, uh, 500 gigabytes with USB 2.0 and Firewire 400. And it was a 149 uh, US. That was a pretty good deal for 500 gigs of storage. It's going to be perfect for a time machine, which is the reason that I got it. So. Go ahead and unbox this bad boy. Let's see if this will help you guys out a little bit there. Alright. Cut it out of the plastic. I think if you buy it from somewhere other than Costco, it won't, won't come in this giant box. Oh, I don't know that for sure. Wow. Sorry, that was a little louder than I expected. All right, here it is, the my book. It says stuff that's included, but I guess we'll see it. So uh, I won't go ahead and read it for you. Compatibility, Windows, Vista XP 2000, Mac OS 10.3 or higher. Uh, 500 gigabytes, they're saying you can store up to 142,000 photos, 38 hours of movies, or 125,000 songs. Which is actually pretty impressive. Let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. It's, it's pretty decent sized. Um, there's a. So, unlike my 160 little uh, passport drive, this one looks like it has a power supply. But we'll go through everything here. So, take off. Packaging. It's actually not that. It's actually not that big. It's a lot bigger than stuff on it. I'll give you guys a uh, comparison here in a minute, since I can get it out of the plastic. It's always fun to uh, open up new things here. All right, so this. This is it. Not uh, terribly big. See me here. Um, this is it. The front of it looks like that's a power button that goes in. Um, on the back, looks like there's power, USB, and two Firewire cables. I don't know why. Two Firewire cables. Um, I don't know why there would be two, but you know there are. Again, there's the USB and the two Firewire. Looks like there's a lock there too and the power. Um, that's kind of how thick it is. Let me show you guys something I'm sure you're all familiar with, the iPhone. Give you a comparison, kind of on size for thickness and stuff. Um, that should give you a sense of how big it is. It's not too small. It's not giant, though, either. And I can sit it right behind my um, MacBook Pro, and I'll probably never even notice it. Let's see what else it came with here. Power brick. Doesn't look that big. It's almost like a cell phone power brick with a... Uh, that type of connection. I don't know if it's proprietary or not, but there it is. A USB cable. Standard USB cable. And they gave you a, or they gave me, a Firewire 400 cable, which is nice, so I don't have to use another one. Alright guys, that's it. My book 500, also known as my Time Machine Drive. 500 gigs should be the last hard drive I need to buy for a while. I'm assuming. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Any questions about the hard drive, let me know. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for sub subscribing. And tomorrow is Leopard Day. And barring them selling out, I guarantee I'll have a copy tomorrow. I'll unbox it for you guys if you don't want to see it. Actually, I kind of want to see it too. So uh, I'll have an unboxing for you and uh, review a little while later. Anyway, guys, for a walkthrough of Leopard, check out Apple.com. They've got a you know, couple minute video on there that shows all the cool features. I'm excited. I know all you guys abroad are excited. Um, I don't know if you're all getting it tomorrow, but you'll certainly get it within a week or so. And uh, we've all waited long enough. 
Um, as a quick heads up, though, to answer your question, some people were wondering if computers yeah. that they bought tomorrow are going to be pre-installed with Leopard. They are not. The answer is no. They are not going to be pre-installed with Leopard. You, you can send it in, send in a coupon. I think it pay ten bucks for shipping, and they'll send you a free copy. And you got to wait a couple weeks for those computers to get out. So I recommend waiting. They may uh, send out some updated MacBooks with Leopard and maybe a MacBook Slim, and who knows. But if you waited this long, let's send a couple weeks. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing, and I'll talk to you later.